All righty. So I want to tell you that you're stupid if you're watching this video and you're an amp. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> All right, before you hit the down like button, I'm just pointing out something that a commenter said, okay? Check this out. He said, there's many other options to gain money than investing in AMP, which he's correct, but just look at his market cap. It will never even reach 0.3 with low capital and billions of tokens. It's really stupid and saying that it's a good investment. And then someone says, I don't think you understand how uh, market cap works. Then another one under that says, uh, he obviously doesn't. All right, so in a video a couple days ago, I pointed out a token that had a low market cap and a low supply and everything. And all of that changed when it, okay? So you have to realize like a lot of this stuff is not solidified and not permanent. You, it, it doesn't matter right now. Supply and demand changes, okay? In business, period, okay? You can call a company and they can tell you we only have three uh, copies of this left. And it could be a scarcity tactic or, you know, that's just because ain't nobody really been playing with it at the time. But then when people start calling in, you know what I'm saying? Like it's things that you can do to manipulate the system, create more, you know, the uh, supply you know when the demand comes in so anyway whether or not the market cap is low or, or or whatever the supply is like he was saying it doesn't mean that it's a stupid thing to think it's a good investment. okay and i'm going to tell you why you guys have to start thinking outside the box and remembering look see a lot of you guys came in this game and you just went straight to youtubers and don't know anything about the stock market, don't know anything about real business. So all you've been taught to mention to this and you think the power is in this when it really is not. The power is in this right here, the white paper, the roadmap. This is where the power lies. If a company is implementing, let me let me like emphasize that because I had a couple of people say, David, uh, you said this was gonna happen and that is gonna happen with AMP and it hasn't happened yet. Let me emphasize that I am not an owner, uh, I'm, I'm not the creator of any of these tokens out here. None of these people that are doing these price predictions, you guys keep coming to us like you want us to read your fortune in, in your palm and stuff. But guess what? They're just predictions and predictions are not 100% accurate because the responsibility of the, uh, the play out of these predictions are not solely on the YouTuber that you're watching. We can only predict based off of the information that we have past, present, and okay. Now, what do I mean by that? We can go off of the roadmap. Majority of the time, my predictions are accurate because I'm not paying attention to this right here. There's no way you can accurately predicted because on uh, September 14th, um, someone farted and then it did a dip right here. And when someone gets gas again, it's going to do another dip right there. See, 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 I was right. That's what you'd be watching on these YouTube channels. And it's hilarious to me. And I see it. And I want to keep you guys safe. I want you guys to be safe with your investments. There's always risks, but the safest way is to know about your investment, know behind the scenes, know who the owners are, the founders, what their goals are. And the white papers and the roadmaps can tell you that. Not just that, you need to be paying attention, not to fake news and fake articles, but you need to be paying attention to their actual uh, accounts and everything. When they release news, their actual accounts like AMP, is a collaborative team, all right? Like, you know, it, it, it is not uh, uh, just, it doesn't just stand alone, you know? What I mean by that is they really go off of their collaboration and their joint ventures and their partnerships. And when you're doing a joint venture and a partnership and you're trying to infiltrate into different networks and you're, you're ran by Flexa and all of that, and Flexa is doing things and, you know, trying to do things in El Salvador and across seas now, and people said in their videos that they would never leave the U.S. They would never leave the U.S. Look at this, man. They pay attention to the real news, what they're really doing. You don't think integrations like this take time? Okay, and Bitcoin just popped up over there in El Salvador, and now it's the nation's capital's uh, currency or uh, whatever, and guess what? Flexa has the technology to speed up and make everything instantaneously, you know, uh, you know, and fraud proof. 
So, I mean, it's going to take a little second for AMP, Flexa, and uh, what I mean is uh, ACH and all of these different types of uh, tokens that really mean something. The ones that are actually doing something behind the scene will eventually pump when these implementations of these collaborations are put into play and laid down and simmered in. That's the prediction right there. Like you can only pay attention to these things, like what's actually going on behind the scenes, real company mergers and stuff like that. That can help. Oh, that can help this move. But like I said, I don't invest into something that I'm not prepared to hold. I'm not looking to trade and swap and all of that. If you guys are panic sellers, then this is the wrong channel for you. I'm just being real with you. What I do is I make money from my real businesses. The one I just showed you on Google, I make money from that. I make money from real businesses. That way, if I invest into something like this that could potentially be worth millions in the future or even billions potentially because it's going to shake up the entire payments in uh, one of these cryptocurrencies, these payment cryptocurrencies is going to be the future. So it's, it's, it's safe to say it could be could be AMP, Cody, or, or uh, ACH, you know what I'm saying? Like it could be one of those and I'm still investigating a few others and stuff, but definitely one of these payments, payment uh, tokens. I don't know how you th guys are thinking mean tokens are gonna replace the dollar. You have to use your logical brain. A dollar is a payment, okay? So like uh, it's only logical that another payment currency and, and integration and software would be the thing that would take over. Okay, so Flexa, Amp, Cody, and a, and a few others that I haven't really got too deep in, you guys have to pay attention to those type of uh, cryptocurrencies, which will be a slow burn over here. But there's a lot of slow burn movies that you've seen that turned out to be awesome, you know, at the end. And the scripture, the Bible scripture says, better is the end of a thing than the beginning. So remember that. That's literally in the Bible. So I strongly suggest, you know, if I was you, I, I would make money in trading the crap coin, but AMP is not one of them. Do that with, uh, 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 you know, you know, a uh, uh, freaking porn rocket, corn, cum rocket, doge, uh, uh, doge killer, Shiba Inu. Do that with those type of uh, cryptocurrencies. Dire Wolf, do that with that crap. Okay, but AMP, ACH, you know what I'm saying? Like tokens like that, even Meta Hero. I like Meta Hero. Even that one, man. Like I would huddle. You know, that's just me, though. All right, if you're new to the channel, do a Jet Li sidekick to the like button. Love you guys.